Good morning, happy Bowtie Friday. I'm Austin Griffith. Today we're looking at the XMoon Exchange. So it starts on the Reddit wallet. So Reddit deployed an ERC-20. You can get to your vault by just going to the Reddit app and clicking that little thing right up there. And then this little vault guy shows up. You click vault, uh, you have to sign up, you have to get ready. You wanna get on slash R slash cryptocurrency so you can start collecting moons. Uh, but here we go, I've got some moons. And basically what you wanna do is hit send and you can put in an address there. Doesn't do ENS, doesn't have a QR code scanner, so you have to copy and paste. But what you wanna do is maybe go to your MetaMask, grab the address, this is what I did. Then go back to your Reddit uh, vault hit send, paste in your address, and send some moons to yourself. And once you do that, what, what I do was send, by, by myself I mean send moons to my MetaMask account, right? Okay, so I've got moons in my MetaMask account. It's just a Rinkaby ERC-20. So XMoon Exchange basically takes uh, Rinkaby, and thanks to the, uh, the crew at XDAI, there's a bridge between Rinkaby moons and what's called X moons. So there are moons on X die, which is pretty cool because then it allow, allows us to have utility and play around with these moons on a, a higher value chain. And if you scroll all the way down on X moon exchange, you see that you have ETH and die. So I'm just going to actually get that started too. So I'm going to move uh, 20 die from uh, mainnet ethereum i'm going to bridge that uh north into xdai and confirm that awesome so we have our first transaction kicked off we are moving uh die to xdai from uh, uh like proof of work eth ethereum chain into xdai a dpos uh side chain right but it's evm compatible so so we've got if you look at this X Moon Exchange, you can see the layers, right? You can see Moon on Rinkaby, you can see X Moon on X Dai, and you can see Dai on ETH, and that's uh, kind of like these varying concerns of security, right? So the bridges, this, so basically, you can imagine that on Rinkaby, whoever's minting these X Moons. Uh oh, I don't even have any Rinkaby ETH. I'm gonna need some of that too. Okay. It took me about four tries with MetaMask, but we got it. Now we're moving Moons from. Uh, the X Moon Exchange in the X Moon Exchange, we're moving moons from Rinkaby into X Die through like a multi sig bridge, right? So, so varying security concerns. It's going to get more and more secure as we move south in this exchange, and we've also moved uh, Die in. So we've we've moved from ETH, we've moved Die into X Die, and then uh, from Rinkaby, we're moving some moons into X Moons. Okay, so the XMoon Exchange is basically uh, a Uniswap clone that I carved out called Minimum Viable Decentralized Exchange or something like that. Basically, I took everything out that, that uh, you, you could possibly not need, <laughs> probably some security things. This is probably going to get wrecked. But basically, uh, it's, it's a Uniswap pool where we have 200 XDAI on one side and about 3,000 XMoon on the other side. And that, that gives you this price. So we just bridged in those 50 moons. So, so let's go ahead and switch our network over to XDAI. Oh, whoa, what did I do? What did I do? Get out of here. If you hover over this, it's going to tell you required network, right? So let's go to XDAI. And I put mine in, but you'll have to set up a custom network. And then once you have XDAI, I've got my $20 that I bridged in from DAI. I bridged up from Ethereum. And I've got my 50 moons that I bridged down from uh, Rinkaby. And here we go. Now we can start interfacing with this. Let's, I'm going to do X moon to X die. So that means it's going to shift that little dot. This is the kind of the price curve right here. If I put in all 50 of my moons, oh, hardly anything, right? Let's see. Uh, if I wanted to wreck this exchange, there we go. Well, it wouldn't wreck it, but basically there's a huge amount of slippage and I'm not getting paid back. But if I were to put in 1,050 moons, I would get $53 back. So someone out there with some moons is going to get paid here. And that's the point. Like I want to get some moons into this exchange and get more liquidity. But right now, all I have is my 50 X moons. Okay. So here we go. Let's, let's bridge. Let's put our 50 X moons in. All right. Confirmation dialogue. Oh, look, there's going to be two of them. Confirm, confirm. Ooh, was that an approve and a transfer in the same block? All right. Now our moons are gone. We can see the curve shift. The prices change a little bit. The reserves change a little bit and we're exchanging back and forth. Right. Oh, OK. So let's let's uh, let's get 
let's put in let, let's put in a dollar. What can I get for a dollar? I can get 15 moons. Let's put in five dollars. I can get 75 moons. Okay, so let's just put two bucks in and hit confirm. And there we go. So now we're exchanging. Basically, you have you have a uh, real die that I brought in and turned into X die, and I'm using that X die to exchange back and forth with X moon. So basically the whole fun part of this is now that we have liquidity from moons all the way to ETH, and it's gonna get wrecked, of course, but now that we have that liquidity, it gives these Reddit moon tokens utility, and we can do some fun stuff with it. Now that we have these X moons on a chain of value, right? Like X die is like a chain of low value. I think the market cap's like 40K. We can play around with these in a real value situation and give utility to these moons kind of ahead of this whole reddit scalability challenge thing and full disclosure i started this long before that this was just playing around with uh x die and x moons okay so check it out the x moon exchange is live if you are a developer let's build something on top of this it's gonna be a lot of fun all right thank you see you happy bow tie friday